This grain has fairly low relief, which we can especially appreciate in comparison to this high relief epidote grain down here. In this case, this mineral has a light brown color and a prismatic habit, but neither the color nor the habit are really characteristic for this type of mineral. If we turn the table, we realize that this grain has extreme pleochroism from light to dark brown. If we look at the grain under cross-polarized light, we realize that it has very high order interference colors, although the brown color of the mineral is covering those interference colors a bit. So it can be tricky to work with interference colors in this type of mineral. If we rotate it under cross-polarized light, we see that it is extinct in a north-south position, which means it has parallel extinction. The extreme pleochroism, the relatively low relief, as well as the parallel extinction are characteristic for tourmaline.